that it wasn't a good idea for you to live together. It was just wasn't good for us to be together. Her love was rejected. Miss Teeter came home and told you that she wanted you to leave. But her ex could sure use her money. Miss Teeter fell behind in her bills. I was a few hundred short, couldn't come up with it. She texted me telling me she was gonna get evicted. I gave her $580. You have to stop making somebody else responsible for you. Judge Judy, 21-year-old Dulce Martinez, is suing her ex-fiance, 22-year-old Victoria Teeter, for a loan to pay rent and move-out fees. Order. All rise. It's case number 394 on the calendar in the matter of Martinez versus Teeter. Thank you. You're welcome, Judge. Fires have been sworn in. You may be seated. Have a seat. Miss Martinez, according to what I've read, you and Miss Teeter were in a relationship and signed a lease together. Yes, that's correct. When was that? We signed our lease uh, September of 20, 22nd of 2017. And it was a one-year lease? 13 months, but yeah. And at some point you left, you moved out. Uh, well, actually, I was told to leave. I'll get to that in a minute. Okay. Tell me what month you moved out. I moved out end of July of 2018. Okay. This is what your lawsuit is about. According to you, Miss Teeter, came home and told you that she wanted you to leave. She was right. no longer interested in maintaining the relationship. You did leave. Mm -hmm. At some point, shortly thereafter, Miss Teeter fell behind in her bills, and one of those bills she fell behind was the rent. According to you, you gave her monies to keep up and maintain the apartment because you didn't want to have your credit destroyed, and that's really what you're suing for now. Right. Miss Teeter, I'm positive, has a different story. She says you left, you abandoned your two cats, she's had somebody taking care of your cats now for a while, she wants money for taking care of them, and she says you took her PlayStation when you left. Miss Teeter, I'm going to start with you. Were you away at all in July? Yes, I had a friend's uh, birthday party camping trip we went on. Where? Uh, McCall, Idaho. Did you meet someone else at the party? Oh, no. It was just strictly friends, just four of us. Tell me what happened when you came home. When I came home, I had, for a while, been thinking it's probably in both of our best interests that we're not together anymore. You weren't getting along? Yes. And when you say you weren't getting along, you weren't getting along to the extent that it wasn't a good idea for you to live together? It was just wasn't good for us to be together. I well, that means, did not... That means living together. Did you have a discussion with Miss Martinez about it? About leaving or about... About it wasn't a good idea for you to be together anymore. Um, yes. Uh, that was the end of July when you came home? Yes. And was that when she left? Yes, short end of, end of July. Did you know where she went? Uh, yes, she said that she was staying with her mom. And this was in 2017? 2018. So you had just a month or so left to go on the lease? Yeah, about two to three months left. And you would split July's rent? Yes, we had already paid. And what about August? Yes, we ended up paying that. And that's even being that she left the apartment? Yes. But she still contributed to August's rent? Yes. What happened in September? In September, I paid all of rent by myself. I borrowed some money from a couple of family members to get by, and she had kicked out our previous roommates, so I had that's why I had to pull out, borrow money from some family members and stuff to pay it all by myself. So it was just me paying it all in September. So now it's October. October, like I said, didn't have the roommates anymore, and I tried to find a couple of roommates, but finding roommates for about two months is a little bit harder than some might think. And so I was a few hundred short, couldn't come up with it. So how much did Miss Martinez give you? In October? None. So did you pay any rent in October? No, I... Did they... you live there in October? For a part of October, yes. October, your lease was up? Yes.